Chauncey Wiggins and Dylan Hunter. Uh, go over the questions and how you guys are ready. Mm -hmm. Chauncey, 16 points in the first half. Just sort of what led to that assertiveness on offense tonight. Um, you know, just trying to be one of the uh, top scorers and just do everything on the court. Um, you know, had had a good sophomore year, so I knew my role was going to be bigger going into my junior year. So just trying to be aggressive every night. Talking to Brown on Monday, sort of laying out what his expectations are for you. I guess what are the conversations you two have had, sort of what his he's laid out for you heading into your junior year? Yeah, just uh, trying to do everything. You know, get rebounds, start to break. Um, don't make a lot of turnovers. Defend the best player out there, and not score the ball. So we have many talks about that. Is this all a turnaround jumper from you and OSU or Josh? Is that part of your game? Uh, yeah, I've probably been working on that ever since like high school. Uh, you know, I'm not the biggest guy, so I'm not. I know I'm not going to be backing down a lot of people, but I can at times. So uh, I just knew the defender wasn't going to really contest me, and um, yeah, I just made it. How good is it? Oh my gosh, it felt amazing. I was just telling like my mom and dad, like I'm like just so happy we're about to play somebody else. You know, mm -hmm. we playing each other every day. We all tired, knees hurt, <laughs> but it was it was just a fun day today, just playing somebody else. Uh, I would say it's definitely a, pro a process, but uh, we're definitely coming along. You know, a couple new guys. We've been with them all summer, though. Like, we go out to eat regularly on the daily, uh, hang out with each other. So, we're definitely getting there. Do you see it defensively or offensively is kind of the most, what's mostly picked up? Uh, I would say right now, well, our offense, we're moving and doing it well, but our defense, you know, coach is real. They put an emphasis on defense, so he always wants to get better. <laughs> so, that's our main focus right now, just improving our defense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, you know, we're just about to uh, scout. Um, they have a real real good team out there. Uh, they f have a former Grayson alum, Tajay Kelly. You know, he's going to be a very good player. I know they got some good guards over there. So, you know, we're just going to rest up, uh, scout for them, have some days of practice, and then we'll be ready for the opener. Mm -hmm. coming, coming off the season you guys had last year, did you all feel like the pressure you know, to kind of live up to maybe some higher expectations now? Uh, well, I would say, no, not really. We know, like, what it takes to get to that stage and, like, the work in the summer. Um, you know, well, us being the younger guys, too, on that team, we know, like, now we have to step up and lead and show what the other younger guys, like, what we had to go through and just be a team. So we understand what it takes to get back to a certain position like that and uh, know it's going to be a, a process. Mm. Dylan, you play any role in recruiting Chase or back the year? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, I would say, well, because last year around this time, we weren't, I didn't even know he could come back or like we didn't know, honestly. And then uh, I would say, like, before um, the tournament, I guess like we were just talking about it and stuff like that. But like, we knew, like, even on the run, we knew it was like, man, we want to just keep going, keep doing this. Like, he got another extra year. We know he's old as on the what. But, uh, but uh, yeah, we're just happy to have him back. And yeah, it's a family here at Clemson. It's kind of weird how old he is. <laughs> Uh, like, well, some of the uh, younger players don't really, because they'll ask me, like, how is Chase like? Because, you know, he's older now. He goes home. He not, like, hanging out. He, man, he got a young girl at home, so he just go home and chill. So, yeah, I mean, it's funny, though, but he's still a young guy at heart. Like, he still play around with us, goofy and chill. Like, so it's definitely funny, though, to see him interact with other players. Mm-hmm. Oh, very confident. You know, right now I'm letting it fly. Like, it's no more backing off. Uh, didn't knock down every shot I wanted to today, but that, that happened. It's basketball. So I'm just improving for tomorrow and just keep shooting. Mm -hmm. Chauncey, tell me about the difference between the start of last year and this year. What do you feel energy-wise as you start the new season? Um, I would say, you know, ever since that Elite Eight uh, run happened, it's been a lot of energy uh, this summer. Um, also, going into last year, we didn't make the tournament. And I was kind of like made us mad and all that. So uh, the energy's high right now, and we're just uh, looking forward to the season. Mm -hmm. Any more questions for these guys? Okay. Thanks, guys. Thank you all. Thank you all. Appreciate y'all. He's the uncle, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, dude.